And welcome, welcome back, guys, to the Dark Side Detective. It's your favorite YouTuber, Bradley Overrated. I'm your favorite, right? God, who am I kidding? Of course I am, all 32 subscribers. All right, guys, we're on the last episode. This is Dawn of the Dead. Seriously, these, these references, all of these, every single one of these has been a reference to something. It's fantastic. I love it. So let's just jump in. The chief summoned us all to the debriefing room about a code red citywide issue. Now we're talking. Now this is apparently the last case. Um, I'm hoping for two more. I don't know. There's two gaps over here. Maybe there are. Maybe there aren't. Let's find out. Ooh, that music. Right off the bat, man. This is gonna be a good one. I can already tell. When it when it loads up, that is. Takes a little bit of time to load up. Chief's going. Is everyone here? Good. There are riots all over the city, so it's all hands on deck. That means you too, McLean. Time to do some real police work. Are you sure your iffy stomach is able for it? You two, stop it! Officer Murakami was wounded in the field, but he's been cleared by medical to give us a briefing on what's happening out there. Thanks, Chief. Guys, I've not seen anything like it before. Hordes of angry citizens shambling around, attacking one another, and smashing up the place. It all seems so mindless. We don't know what's causing this behavior, but we need to get out there and stop it. Be careful out there, and good luck. Squad dismissed. Ooh, states in a state of panic or arrest. Hospitalizations, collateral damage, and purchase of spooky soundtracks are all... <laughs> By the way, collateral damage means civilian deaths. Thought of the day. New detective. My first day on the job and we get to tackle a riot? How exciting! Ten bucks the newbie doesn't make it through the day. Hey! I'll take that bet, McKean. You'll do fine, detective. Actually, what's your name? Fish. Fresh fish. <laughs> So stupid, yet so funny. Okay, let's see here. Uh, this is a huge kind of case. All right. How's your arm? Perp tried to bite me. Bulletin board. My name is next to the museum. I shop downtown in an old mafia mansion. Looks like it's gonna be a busy day. Am I supposed to do something here? I better get Dooley and hit the road. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. How interesting at this one. Look at this. I got three sections to choose from. Ooh, 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 ooh. Sorry. I'm gonna. Let's try Mansion. Let's go Mansion. We have reports of a break in at the Don's old mansion. Let's check it out. Detective, the city is in chaos. Surely we've better things to focus on than a derelict building. We don't know who they are or why they broke in. The mansion belonged to a Mafia Don. For all we know, there is a hidden weapon cache in here. Given how crazy things are across the city today, whatever they want, we had better make sure they don't get it. Take this flag! Was this had a good use of police resources in time? No. Was it fun? Yes. You built a sandcastle. Fantastic. Let's go. Luckily, the law doesn't apply to us. Duly, the law does apply to us. Just not in this particular case. Yeah, I'm ready to go in. Let's go in. Uh, approach the mansion. Let's go. What? This must belong to whoever is in here. This stuff looks dangerous. I'd better power it down for now. Battery? Anything else, anything else, anything else? A sign. A condemned sign. I don't see why it's condemned. Looks like a perfectly fine sign to me. <laughs> I shouldn't laugh at those stupid jokes. What is wrong with me? Okay. Sir, you can't be here. This place is condemned. Brains! That's not right. Is there somebody there? Yes, are you okay? I'd be a lot better if it wasn't trapped in here by that thing. Wrong! Hold on, we'll do something. Hit it with the painting.
This seems to be the rope that holds the chandelier in place. Seems to be stuck. What a potentially conveniently located table. We need scissors or something. Let's go see those pots. Nope. Open the cupboard. Candles. Ooh, I can light the flame on, possibly burn the rope. Check everything. Check everything. Sorry, there's a lot to check in this one, so I'm not reading it all. <laughs> Hope that's okay. Cough, what a stink. Somebody forgot to clean out the fridge when this place was condemned. Anything in there I can eat? Duly, it's all rotten. But I'm so hungry. You make things sound so urgent. So I skipped second breakfast. This is urgent, Duly. Fine, but after all this, you're buying me pancakes. Totally fair, in my opinion. Anything in the oven? No. Take the cup. Steel wool. Great, basically a sponge. Okay, so we got a sponge. We've got a battery. Okay, so I've searched everything at this point now. There is absolutely... This is it. I don't know. I, tr I need to light it. I don't have anything to light it with. I can put it on the rope? I can put it on the table? Give it to the zombie! I don't know. Let's just leave this here. Oh, okay, conveniently placed table, I get it. So now you can light it with something. Combine! Blood wolf trick, combine a battery with steel wool to make a fire starter. Little Emily taught me that. That's plausible. I'm not gonna lie, I didn't actually think that would work. Okay then, let's go. Bam. This should be able to burn through the rope in a suitably slow and dramatic fashion. Ow. It's uh, safe to come out now. It's now a good time to mention I'm allergic to fire. Roxa? You guys, I owe you big time! What are you doing here? Actually, for no reason, no reason at all, we should go outside before you tell us. And we burnt the place down. Wonderful. Thanks for saving me back there, and I need a drink of water. Oh yeah. That's good stuff, guys. Sorry, really thirsty. Are you okay? I am, thanks to you guys. What's with the getup? I'm an inspooker now. Since I kept finding myself in weird going goes on, I licensed myself for a franchise. But there was a localized storm here last night, so I knew that meant something was happening after the events at the library. Good catch. Is this your equipment? It is. A spooktometer. Do you like it? It reads for spooktivity. I brought it with me to help get readings. But I got trapped in that room and didn't get to look at the readings yet. Trapped by that creature? Later, yes, but not at first. There were people here searching the place. Their accents were hard to understand, but they were looking for the Don. But he's been dead for a while. Yeah, they left when they realized that. I waited a while to make sure they didn't come back. But then that thing burst out of the floor and I was trapped again. So what do the readings say? That's odd, the battery is missing. Thankfully, there's a printout inside. Give me a second while I open it up. Wow, lots of spiritual readings. Whoever whatever was looking for the dawn, they weren't human. I don't think we'll find anything else out here. Let's get back to the next crime scene. Roxa, you should leave too. Because of the fire? Fire? No fire here. No, we should all leave for other non-fire reasons. Bye. Yeah, we didn't we didn't burn a mansion down to the ground. Uh -uh. All right, moving on. Chinatown. Here we go. This is where you got McNuggets retirement urn. What a fun party! We spent the entire time chasing around monsters, chasing memories. You mean? <laughs> That's right. Always looking at the positive side of things, Dooley. That's why I love you, man. Stringless tennis racket in here. Sweet. A dirty magazine? Deep clean! Oh, baby, baby. Drain pipe. Painted onto the building. Go inside. Check the squad car real quick. 
shop window. Let's do it. Whoa. Are those paws? Nah, they couldn't be. Help! I'm trapped! Get rid of them! Sorry, I'm not trying to sound racist. I'm just trying to have new voices, okay? Is that skull real? That's the skull of the previous shop owner. Her will stipulated I keep it on display at all times. Lucky cat. Dreamcatcher. These are trapping nightmares. Might be useful in this nightmare. Now we're talking. Ooh, healing crystals. Mm. Yes, yes. A lantern. Take the lantern. A, sh <laughs> a shop like this runs on ambience. 80% of all sells out because customers can't see what they're buying. Well, the dream catcher. This is sharp. I need, I need string for the racket. You have string. I can use the sharp edges to cut the dream catcher. Yeah, exactly. And then we use a string on the broken tennis racket. And then I can use the to capture these guys. Boom! Monkey pars. Pause. There you go, buddy. I'm not coming out till those things are gone. Oh. Okay, well, I'll take the monkey paws. Monkey paws. I can't say paws today for whatever reason. There. That's this area. <laughs> Locked down. Thank goodness you came off us. I don't know how else I have escaped. You guys, they could have sent me some other cops. The whole force is busy. This is harassment. You called us. What happened here? My lucky rapper's foot. The monkey paws. The body out back. They all started moving. Body out back. I never said that. You've got no proof. Dooley, you hear him? Hmm? What's happening? I tuned out. You were asking so many questions. All this started not long after my store was robbed last night. Tell me more about the robbery. Last night, some goons loaded in. They smashed the place up and took some entirely legal ritual components. Ritual components doesn't sound legal. Good thing for me that the evidence was stolen then. Floated in? Yep, floated in in a green haze. That sounded like Darksiders to me. I don't think we'll find anything else here, Dooley. I'm not sure what Darksiders are doing here, but we need to get to the next crime scene. Voila, here we go. Next up is the museum itself. Always a pleasure, right, to go to the museum of things? Why is that door smashed in? Looks like a break in. Looters? Maybe, but they tend to go over televisions, not tapestries. Let's check it out. Double check everything. Woo-wee! Those Egyptians were big. Those pictures aren't to scale. I do that. Ooh, dinosaur. An impressive specimen. There seems to be something stuck in here, but it's too far for me to reach. Ooh, I gotta find something to grab whatever's in the thing. After watching extensive historical footage, Twin Lakes researchers believe this beast escaped a Costa Rican theme park in the early 90s. Presumed cause of death is drowning, as its tiny arms wouldn't have been great for swimming to the mainland. Now the team here must be top of the field. <laughs> oh, Jurassic Park, what a great movie that was. Not delicious water. Of course, they're talking about Jurassic Lost World, which was mediocre. Short skeleton. An ape, probably. What a fine institute of learning this is. <laughs> All skeleton. This is what a plastic skeleton looks like. Scientists think it may be what the human body was modeled on. Fascinating. Curiosity cabinet. Okay, there's gotta be something else, I guess. What on earth? That looks like a mummy. Ugh. 
I don't know how or why, but that thing must have come out of that sarcophagus. I better look for a way to lure it back in there. A scepter. Accept her? I don't even know her. Wait, who are we talking about? So I gotta get him back in there. Um, smashed cabinet. Jib of Osiris. The D Egyptian death god? I can't help but think that's tied in with what's going on across the city. Let's see here. Maybe I can use the scepter on the dinosaur to reach something? Whoop! I wonder if I can use this to dislodge whatever he ate. Beautiful! Bird bones. That must have been Tony Rex's last meal. Tony? The T has to stand for something. Yeah, it certainly isn't Tyrannosaurus. I gotta figure out how to get in there, too. Okay. Club them with it. I don't know. I don't know. These might work as a makeshift lock picking kit. A very fragile kit. Here we go. Maybe if I match these bones to the tumblers in the lock, I'll be able to open up the cabinet. Let's see here. Oh, wait, you gotta do it in order. Never mind. You're close. But no cigar. It's like Tetris. Oh. <laughs> that one's an interesting one. Oh, there it is. It wasn't that interesting. And you. Ta da! That seems to be it. Now to see what's inside. Brain jar. A jar of pickled brains. I prefer pickled onions myself. Well, you don't have to tell me what to do now. Sorry, pickled brain, but I need to take care of some undead business. Yum! Ta-da! There's a case closed pun in here somewhere, but there's just no time. Dooley, I just figured it out. The dark side is what looking for something at the Don's house. They were looking for the Don. But you said he was dead. Which is why they took the Gym of Osiris and the ritual components. They're trying to resurrect him. Wow, Detective, what an amazing coincidence that every place the Chief sent us was tied in so tightly with what's really going on. <laughs> if we had been sent even to one different location, you may never have pieced it all together. There's no time to work out the undoubtedly small probability of things having worked out like this. We need to get to the graveyard. And fast, we can't let him return. Booyah. I wonder if we can get an overview of the situation from here. It's what I feared. The place is swarming with zombies. These must be the dark side as we've heard about. They're firing at somebody inside the church. I can't make out who, though. Look, Dooley, over there. There's some bad mumbo-jumbo happening at the crypt. We need to stop them from bringing the dawn back. Okay, Dooley, let's go! Oh, I guess they did it for me. Whatever. No doubt about it. Those zombies, alright. Looks like we're not getting in that way. Maybe not, but maybe there's something I can... He's on the squad car again? Oh. Yay! He's got a nightstick. Just what I needed. But I only have a nightstick! What am I supposed to do about that? Beat the zombies! Oh, you actually beat him. Finally, a positive application for police brutality. Eh. Well, its hand broke off, but it doesn't seem to care. We might need another way in. Awesome! You don't get to keep your nightstick? 
use the zombie arm on the... Okay, in position now to squeeze his muscle and got it! A plank? Nope, it's a festive term right, it's not putting that in my pocket. Okay, well, oh wait, 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 I know what to do. Close the dumpster, close the dumpster, here we go. Here we go guys, he's the oil can on the dumpster. Okay, that's the wheels oiled up. Let's push this into position, Dooley. Okay, Dooley, I'll go over the wall. You go through the sewers. Hopefully that way one of us can save those people and stop the Don from being brought back. Have I mentioned that I don't like ton... Not the time, buddy. The city needs us. I know. Hey, detective. Yeah? Be careful. You too, buddy. You too. I like these two. I really do. <gasps> I'm Dooley? No! Oh my gosh, I'm Dooley. That's why he's blocked off by a large gate. What secrets are you hiding, gate? When all this is done, I'm going to launch an investigation into you. I call it the Gate Gate. Gosh, take it. <laughs> oh, that's, that's clever, though. That's really clever. Great, okay. Pipes. Pumps. Uh, right. This is how they go. Oh, same thing. Okay. Oh, what's up, Sewer Gator? Hey, little guy, what are you doing down here? Snarl! I'm watching my stories. Let me be. A gator in the sewers. Watching TV. Well, that story checks out to me. Enjoy, mister. Just keep an eye out for cannibals. TV show on urban legends. What nonsense. <laughs> No way. Now they got <laughs> the Sewer reference, and now we got Pennywise! Hello, Dooley. Aren't you gonna say hello? One second there, guy. What's a clown doing down here? Is This is it, a circus. Uh, I give balloons to wayward kitties. Do you now? And uh, there's cotton candy and rides, and all sorts of um, surprises down here. Surprises? Did I mention the balloons come in all colors? Hmm, I see no harm in any of this. Good on you for making sure those kids aren't frightened. Uh, thanks. As you were. You too? <laughs> Hello, Georgie. Oh, that's fantastic. That boat's not the only thing floating down here. Oh my gosh, this is fantastic. These references are lit. This box holds all the power to the city, electrical and political. Can I have a balloon? No, I can't. Just gonna move it right along. Hello again, officer! What brings you down sewers? Ah, uh, you know, us cops always waiting in the filth of humanity. But why are you here? Oh, we're repairing the power lines. You've noticed all those flickering lights across the city recently. We're gonna fix that. That sure is great. A great excuse. Do you think I'm an idiot? Uh, I see a sign. That's an inverted eye. You guys are amazons. Refrigerate. Well, no, the other one. Freeze. I'm at freeze. <laughs> Refrigerate. That's what I'm gonna start saying when I, when I play a police game now. This is why so many of my TV dinners spoiled. Drop your stuff and get out of here. I'd arrest you, but I've got places to be. What are you talking about? We're just here to just take rest, is it? I guess we gotta listen to the officer and take rest of the day off, tidies. Sure, it'll be nice to get home to the family early for a change. Hole in the wall. Digging a hole to the planet hidden inside our planet. <laughs> I'm building a lair for the lizard people who secretly rule over us. Maybe they're planning to sacrifice something to the moment. Whatever it was, it's been thwarted. Can you take the sign? I don't know what he... Ooh, hello. Kango hammer. Now we're talking. Construction parts. Can I use this on the hole in the wall? Kind of nice. Move on, move on. Sewer gate. Use the hammer on the sewer gate. When life gives you lemons, smash those lemons with a the hammer. Then set the lemon carcasses back to life so it knows not to mess with you again. 
Uh, yeah, exactly. Meanwhile... Ah, water. So good, guys. So good. Here we go. Painting himself into a corner. Nobody heard what happened to him. Drowned in a stack overflow. Crushed by writer's block. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. Eaten alive by bugs. Ooh. Looky here, Slim. We got us a stray zombie. Hmm, yeah, I'll stray. Five few rounds and chase it off and be thankful we ain't got a whore to deal with. Heh <laughs> horde. Oh man, I'm getting shot at. What am I supposed to do now? Go oh. We've been breached. Charge! Oh wait, cranky. I do apologize. I thought you were the hun. Come to munch up my brain for military secrets. But I can tell now you're a Yankee boy and in the stance not rigged enough soldiers like melted ice cream on a sunny Sunday morning. Uh, yeah, give me that shovel. What? Can I have a helmet? It's poor from the commentary of the man's piece, old chap. Gas mask? Boots? They're yours. Belong to a sergeant of mine. Thanks. Wait a second. Those aren't no more boots. They've got metal sockets in them. And we have mechanical legs. <laughs> Needed special shoes. That would click on. That's why I have no use for them. Hmm. Yeah. How generous. Great. I've got boots. Thanks. Grave digger. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Oh, there's a water tower. Let's see here. Pipe. Nothing. Scaffolding. Scaffolding. Perfect. That's just what I need. And ladder. Water tower. The moon. Add another crime scene, eh, moon? I think it's time we had a little talk down at the station. I don't know. What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, hang on, I can move more. Brains! I can't get past them, but maybe I can find a way to get over them and get through that broken window. I need to get out of here before I get munched on. Well, uh, can I please have a gas mask? Who are you? Brigadier Virgil Smith, Smithy to my friends. Of course I have the friends. No type of friends in the army, eh? Surely you're not still in the army. My dear chap, when you sign up, you sign up for life. You're a military man. Can you help gear me up for the fight? Help with the war effort? Sounds spiffy. I still have my military kit. Let's see. Here's my mess tin, but things seem messy enough here already. A water bottle, but it's been shot up. A ground sheet. It's not looking good, old chap. Tell you what, take my gas mask. Thanks. Are you okay? You look like you've been through a lot. This, this is just a scratch. You should have seen the hun when we were done with him. How long have you been here? He doesn't even know. Alright, great. Hey, I can have the gas mask though. Beautiful. Combine stuff. I don't know. Let's just try stuff. Oh, there we go. Stilts. Ooh, can I wear them now? Let's try these out. Sweet! They can't get me all the way up here. Ah, brains! <laughs> I can get a broken window now. Oh, the goon shot out the window, giving me a handy way in. Agent McScream, what are you doing here? What are any of us doing anywhere? 
Helpful as ever. I need to save whoever is trapped in the bell tower, then figure out a plan to get to the crypt and stop that ritual. I can exit. Where's the fun of that? Chief Gooley. Uh, what's going on here? What are you doing in the bright side? Uh, Meet Ennards. Are you okay? Been shot, son. Right in the gut. So it was you and McScream those goons were shooting at. That it was, son. But I got from the inside out. I am dark side bullets is not like yours. With what with them being full of cursed components, as it were. What can I do to help? Can we remove the bullets? Cannot be removed normally, son. I need some purified water to wash the badness out. I'll have a look around. As you are there, son. Full of old caked in moldy smelling incense. Yay. Can't take a candle. Can I take this? Alright. To the vestry! Letter opener? Huh? Nice. Blocky dogs count. Dang it! Freaking jokes. They're so fun. They are so fun. This game is just fun, guys. It's a lot of fun. I'm really enjoying it. If only I could figure out what I was supposed to do next, though. To the bell tower! Get back, demon bro! Oh, thanks, buddy. Great, now I'm soaked. Gnarly! Thought you were a hollow head. Total wipeout on my am, bro. Do you have a towel I can borrow? What's in your sports bag? Scuba tanks. Dude, I like to extreme to the max, and you can't extreme to the max without painting your face. But the scuba tank is bust. I lost my mouthpiece. I'm gonna throw it out. Mind if I take it? Sure, dude. Enjoy. What am I supposed to do with the scuba tank? Hey, does he have holy water? What was that about? Holyheads don't like holy water. My friend amigo turns them into mush burgers. Good to know. I came to save you. Are you okay? Given the circumstances, I'm happy to be topside and not drowning in a swell of undead. We need to get you out of here. If you could cause a break in that wave of undead, I could get myself out, dude. And how will I do that? Like the surfer listens to the sea, maybe you should listen to the dead. That actually might work. Good idea. The Lord speaks through me, Broseph. What's with the sports gear? I was meant to be going on an extreme sports holiday, but I stayed to bless some babies. Bro, I will not make that mistake again. <laughs> Can I have some holy water? Far out, dude. Happy to share the Lord's liquid. Don't say it like that. I'm way low right now. Wasted my last wipe out on you. But you can have my dregs. But dude, it's not enough to mush a hollow. <laughs> uh, I like I like the preacher, dude. He's pretty cool. Oh, here you go. Use this to wash out your wound. Much better. Thank you, son. Thank you for that, son. Feel better now? Much better. Ready to fight the forces of evil once more. I knew I was right about you. Good egg, this one. Goodbye. Good day, son, and Godspeed. What was the point in that? Like, really, what was I supposed to do after that? Vestry? No. How do, how do I leave again? What's up, buddy? I saved your teammate. I spoke with Ghoulie. Does he still fester in the pits of agony? He's recovering now. Only if you consider getting better to be recovering. <laughs> Gosh dang it. <laughs> this guy's so emo. I love it. Uh, I should investigate the area and decide what to do next. As must we all. My makeshift entrance. I can still hear the zombies outside. Brains, 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 brains. Sounds like they're arguing. If only I could understand them. Hiya! I think I need to stab it. Just kidding. That's not gonna work. 
sometime later. That was easier than I thought. Everything is easy for the ignorant. Hey, okay, let's find out what those zombies are saying. Hey, brains, brains, brains. Your brains, my good brains. Wait, what? Sometime later. Why did you do that? Why was there some time? I don't know what to do! <laughs> I'm so stopped! <laughs> wait, 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 what? Sorry, Cope, I need to look more undeadish. What? Did, why did, 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 did. Are you serious right now? Are you serious? I've been clicking on the shirt like four times before. What changed? I don't know what changed, you guys, but look, I did it! I'm now somewhat looking like a zombie. Now can I use this? Okay, that's just stupid. I tried that too earlier and it didn't work. Aw, oh, man. That's, a, that's annoying. That was annoying. So, I did everything right. I apparently had to just talk to this guy or look out the window before I could actually proceed though. How stupid, right? Here, put this on your head. Let's go. They seem angry and confused. Alright, let's do it. I smell dead, my clothes look right, but I still look too alive to pass as one of them. You got anything for me? Can you use your face paints to make me look undead? I could do that 110%, bro. Percents only go up to 100 110, bro. 110. Fine. Oh, there we go. Look at that. I'm a beautiful zombie. I'm so beautiful. So beautiful. Let's do this. Let's do this. Here we go. Okay, I should be able to pass this one of them now. Brains. Brains. Brains, brains, brains. Brains, brains, brains. Okay, they've agreed to unionize under my leadership. Time to go talk to the people who brought them back. Right. Mama B, it's a zombie horde. Run, Slim. Yeah, run. Beautiful, beautiful. Enter the grips. Oh, here we go. Stop right there. Too late, bread setter! Rah, I live! Al Corpson. Uh, well, Al Corpsoni. <laughs> rah, I live, see? Yeah, rah. He is no zombie, he is a human, you fools. Brains! Oh no. Destroy him! Brains! So, this is how it ends. Not with a bang. But with me whimpering. I think this is about to get. Nice job, Dooley! Dooley for the win! Dooley's my boy. Dooley, he's trapped in the rubble with all those zombies. I need to save him. <gasps> no, not Dooley. The priest said that the holy water turned them into mush, but where would I find enough of it? Magical paint? So Don's body. Yep, magical paint. I don't understand why a floating being needs a ladder to paint on walls, but I'm glad they do. This could make a passable walkway. Oh no, not Dooley! Groan, semi-conscious. Why aren't you trying to eat him? Brains. <laughs> oh wait, here we go. Now let's go, let's go, let's go. We gotta save him. What do I do, what do I do, what do I do, what do I do? Mafia car. They stole a good solid car. Woe betide anything that this crashed into. Oh, what? Shiny. Those goons must have dropped these before running off. Okay, what am I supposed to do with car keys? Mm, I have a scuba kit. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> Take this. Quickly, put this on, buddy. 
Okay. What was the point in that? No. <laughs> I need you to bless the water tower for me. Bro, are you for real, bro? I've got all the undead into the sewers and need to flush them fast. I've been waiting to be asked to churn out that much god juice, like, literally forever. You have a distinct way of talking about your faith. What can I say, bro? The Lord is my surf guy. We hang tight and hang often, and I want to bring the whole world out on the waves with us. But we, the Lord and I, take safety much o serioso. Take this life ring with you in case you get caught up in the flood. A flood to wash the sinners away. Super biblical, bro. Super biblical. Dude, bro, I'm gonna do my thing, bro. May the big G be on your side. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> what was the life ring and car keys and paint and I'm I'm sure this is gonna work out well for me. Oh, you know what? I just realized why do I use the car keys on the freaking car? Gosh, I'm stupid. Okay, Dooley, I'm ready. I'm ready. Are you ready up there, Father? Cowabunga! I'll take that as a yes. Best of luck, dude. I'm off to my vacay. The pedal's locked in place and the car is good to go. I hope my aim is true. Oh, wow. This is... This seems like a terrible idea. Yeah, save Dooley! <laughs> we giving him the scuba tank! I don't even know why that worked! Are you kidding me? Alright, that's good. Hey Dooley, you okay though, buddy? <coughs> Feeling a little wet behind the ears, but I'm okay. Glad to hear it. Oh no! Ah. You took my millions, I'll have to create new ones, starting with your friend! <coughs> Hold on, Dooley! Damn it, if only there was a way I could send the dawn back to the dark side. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. Take that. Combine them. I didn't... Gosh, the things that work sometimes. I need to copy the ritual markings onto this ring to turn it into a makeshift portal. Okay, that should be all of it. My improvised portal is ready for use. Ooh, yeah, baby. I just need to take careful aim. No! <laughs> Got him! Enjoy your exile back to the dark side. You okay, Dooley? <laughs> I live, detective. Good, I was worried about you there for a minute, buddy. Let's get you out of those sewers. Now then, now then, now then, now then. We has arrested the rest of his accomplices and locked them away. This uncooperated to reduce his sentence. Reverse the ritual side effect that raised the dead in your city. Should be all that the undead is back to being plain old dead now. Good, because I had no idea how I was going to fix that. That was crazy dangerous magic guy. I was young and innocent, easily misled. It happened a half hour ago. I've cut a lot in that time. <laughs> A new man, ready for parole, I'd say! Anyway, we owe you for this, Brightsiders. You're welcome, I'd say any time, but let's make sure this never happens again, eh? Absolutely. Let's get the processing in this lot, eh, Edget? Boom, baby. Sometime later. Dick Brickman here with Detective McKean, who just received a medal for stopping the riots across the city. Can you tell me, Dick Brickman and them, viewers of Dick Brickman, what happened, Detective? There were riots across the city, and <laughs> now there aren't. Light on the details there, Detective. Your wife is the mayor. Is that a conflict of interest? Nope. There you have it, friends. No conflicts and one fancy battle. Congratulations to the Detective. After all that, I can't believe he got a medal instead of you, Detective. Oh. Sorry. After all that, I can't believe he got a medal instead of you, Detective. They're saying that the water tower burst a few days prior and got tainted by dead bodies before leaking into the reservoir, giving everyone temporary madness. 
At least we know what happened. You're a hero, detective. Thanks, buddy. That means a lot. <laughs> Case closed. All right, guys, that's it. Woo, I'm clapping. That was enjoyable. Look at that. The rest of the cast. Vivian Moonman, very real actor. Produced by Spooky Doorway. Gotta say, Spooky Doorway, that was fun, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I really enjoyed The Dark Side Detective. I thought this was a lot of fun. I will do a review of it next week, but I just wanted to say I had a blast, and I hope you guys did too. Thank you so much for joining me on this adventure. Be sure to like and subscribe, boys. I am Bradley Overrated. And before I go, though, I just wanted to say... Indie games are fantastic. When you play games like this that are just... They're so lighthearted and just fun. I kind of hope they make a sequel now. I'm not going to lie. If they did a Dark Side Detective 2, I would, I would buy that day one in a heartbeat. Just because this was really fun in so many ways. And I'll give a full review of it. But I really hope you enjoyed this little adventure with me. And I will see you guys on the next... Let's play or overrated review or screenshot thought or whatever it is that I choose to do during that time. And I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.